salutations queens and kings welcome back to another unboxing video and as you can see we are trying misfits again this time they actually had the option to customize our box so we were excited to order exactly what we wanted pick out some things from the marketplace and then get our box delivered conveniently to our door so before we get into the content as always remember to hit the subscribe button so you can be a part of our queen and king tribe and also hit the notification bell so that you're notified whenever we post dope videos like this one and share this video with your friends and family members so that way they are notified and can notified as well and can join the tribe as well so without further ado let's get into it I will make sure that I leave the um, link down below to where we purchased this from. Your box comes with some nice insulation. And again, this is from Misfit. I believe you can see, yep. But you know I'm not, you know, pulling, <laughs> pulling over on you. And it comes with some insulation in your box. Also some ice packs. I'm gonna set that to the side. And this piece hold down belongings and let's get into it. So right here we have some organic purple broccoli. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Some microgreens. And this is actually we're actually growing microgreens right now. And I will actually put the link in here so that you can be directed to that video and you can check it out afterwards as well. Because we just did step one of planting our microgreens with some apartment gardening that we're doing. And it's actually some broccoli that we planted. So I'm excited to see how that's going to go. And we have some fresh mint here. Really needed mint. I make mint and cucumber water right here. And this is some sage thyme and basil, I believe. Sage, rosemary, and thyme. Ooh, oyster mushrooms these to me look um like i saw someone cook them online they look like sauteed chicken so i was like i'm going to do like a little fake and they'll fake myself out avocados and more paper more filling Ooh, look at this y'all very very nice and swiss chard Another apple. And here we have some butter leaf lettuce. And ooh, yellow peaches. And I hope there is another contain. I want to open this so bad. But uh, for the purposes of the video, ooh, it's two really large ones in here. Oh, y'all, I love peaches. And the season for peaches is just about up. So I'm trying to get as much peach in my system as possible. Some more butter, butter lettuce. And oh, some more mint, thank goodness. I love the way mint smells. We have uh, some more, oh, I just grab. Oh, I think the apple cracked. Some more apples. And I grabbed one of the apples. I don't like surprises, okay? So when I grabbed that, just imagine what that felt like. I was like, oh my goodness. Like what? What was that? Why did it? <laughs> why did it feel that way? A lot of apples. A lot of apples. That's very, very good. Their apples are always so fresh. We have some rainbow shard here. This looks so, so good. I'm gonna look at some recipes and cook this up. Also have some scallion here, green onion, whichever you prefer. Two of those. Two of them things. And now it got me nervous reaching around in here because after that 
after that apple situation. Mm -mm. Nice hell. Nice bunch of hell. Oh, this is about to go down. Majority of this, some of this is going to get juiced. Oh, look at this. I'm going to do some kale shots tomorrow. Take some shots of kale. Oh, yes. This is just what I wanted. Oh, no, y'all. Okay, I'm going to get to this. Y'all can see what I'm talking about. What I, what I just saw. They have some more peaches in here. I believe it's two more yellow ones. These peaches are huge. You see how big? I have to open this. Uh, and I'm trying to open it without one second. Eureka! <laughs> oh my! Look how big this peach is. I don't get them this big. Okay, this is beautiful. Oh yes! Oh, those are huge. Okay, nice mango. We have two mongos. Nice. Nice and clean. Nice and fresh. Okay, I see y'all. I see y'all. Some more apples. Thank goodness we needed some apples. The apples at our store. I wanted to take y'all through a tour of our um a tour of our grocery store so bad just so you can see. If you all would like a tour of our grocery store, just so we can show you the produce that we have to deal with out here let us know because we actually found out after doing our research that the store that we're used to going to to get our produce and frequently complain about fired an employee for um <clears throat> what is it called fired an employee for whistleblowing about the produce i thought that was interesting we have a beet here. I'll make some beet juice. Nice. And do some with the leaves as well, possibly. I'm not I'm not too sure. I don't think I've ever bought a full beet. Um, so I'm not too sure about um using the leaves, whether they'll be bitter or not, whatever, but I'm fine. Perfect. I'll even use them as a garnish or something just so they have used some more apples. cucumber it's a lot of um like dirt you can feel the dirt on some of it like they rinsed it off but you can still feel like a gritty or like sandy feel cucumbers hopefully these are seeded cucumbers what i don't like is the seedless thing this whole seedless grapes and all that stuff my grapes when i was growing up my grandmother feed me grapes they had seeds okay that's what you do stop messing with my food got some limes here i love getting my limes from them because they're a lot um a lot more a lot juicier but these limes look a lot um smaller than the than normal usually they're a lot um fuller these are hard this time and i guess i'll call and inform them of that look at that I am someone who will call and inform customer service of this and just let them know, hey, the produce was not as fresh as I'd like it to be. Like, you can see the dramatic different size. Like, that's crazy. It doesn't look like, it feel like there's any um, juice in those. So, of course, we got about one, two, three more apples in here. Oh. Like, how did you all miss that? That's a completely uh, rotten, rotten. This is the stuff that I don't like digging in and find. That's why I, <laughs> I don't like digging in, you know, boxes and whatnot. Was that a bug? <sighs> Take the little hope now. And some celery. It's pretty broken, but it seems like the box went through something to get here. There's a stock right here missing. <laughs> I don't know. The box came a little bit late, too. Usually it comes bright and early, but um, I know that their delivery, some delivery, depending on where you're state, where you're I said stationed, depending where you are staying right now, is um, a little bit delayed. 
so thank you for tuning in for um this misfits uh, unboxing review i'm gonna go ahead and put all of this stuff away um clean some of it probably and start cooking some of it contact that customer service like i told you let them know hey my box wasn't as fresh as i thought it was going to be this time i'll just let them know about the limes and i'll give you an update on that once i get my next box as always make sure um hit that subscribe button hit that bell give this video a thumbs up share this video with other dope people like yourself dope queens and kings and um we'll catch you next time <laughs>